Hey, good morning guys. Hey, I've got something a little bit different for you today. I'll check back here in just a little bit. Have we got it all? I hope so. Well, alright guys, here we are. So, something got a little new for you today. So, my wife and I are heading down to uh, Belton, Texas to a lake called Steelhouse Hollow. Her and I are fishing a, a, a bass couples tournament today. So I'm going to take you all along with me in that little adventure and see how that goes. Just getting fueled up here in town. And then we're going to make that journey down to our next fuel stop, which is going to be Whataburger. So anyway, guys, I'll catch you all here in just a little bit. Oh yeah, Whataburger. Bass fishing fuel right there. Well, there's our tournament friends that's my buddy John up there all right guys we finally made it out to the water the tournament has commenced so we've already had several teams take off I think they said there was somewhere around 40 in there so anyway and this is gonna be my wife's first tournament and uh oh man this is gonna be fun so he, there he goes he's leaving so anyway guys we're gonna get on across this water let's go find a sufficient spot all right guys so we've been out on our tournament for about 30 minutes already found this little pocket back here with some bunch of little stick up buck brush and things like that oh just wanted to check that out and see doesn't doesn't seem to be panning out real good so we'll just keep looking all right well let's give this a shot and see what happens we'll get back further into these creek arm branches and see if these fish have moved up a little bit shallow mm. Team Bearden gets on the board. There we go, guys, finally. Whew. I'm working for about two hours to get that fish. Let me check him real quick. Uh, finally. Let's see what we got here. I'm pretty sure he's gone past, but going to make sure oh yeah 14 and a half right at 15 that's a keeper that one goes in the well oh yeah all right guys finally after two hours got one in the live well Whew. so so far we're just kind of getting up in these little creek lines back here i'm running about a 52.2 degree water temperature I'm just flipping a soft plastic into these tall reeds over here i think i'm just going to stick with that for right now because it is not very warm outside and we've had nothing but a slow drizzle on us all morning so anyway guys let's keep going let's keep going i thought i got hung up in some weeds or something I got him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a keeper. Good job, baby. Woo. Oh. God dang it, and I lost him. Oh man. Oh god, 1247. Alright guys, just a little quick update. We've been fishing for a couple more hours and haven't had any more success, so we've just been kind of looking around for some places and we're gonna go try to find another cove to back into and see if we can get something maybe going in there. log down in there <laughs> it's so super clear I think that's why it's hard to fish it well, all right everybody so we've worked very hard today we only got about 15 minutes left to get back up to the ramp and uh, just can't secure the other three fish that we need or or some kind of a good good kicker fish to give us a boost so 
Anyway, we're about to crank it up and haul out there. We'll do a weigh-in and see see what we come up with, see where we place. Well, all right, guys. So we're going to conclude our tournament day today. Uh, I thank everybody for watching the video and coming along and seeing what it's like trying to find these fish <laughs> when there's money on the line. And, you know, this, this lake out here that we were at, we came to it for our first time last weekend to do a do a little practice run out here. It's a very tough day of fishing, but anyway, the the bass couple thing is a lot of fun. I got my wife's involved with me in it, fishing as a team member, and you know, so now I can have the two things I love most all at once: so fishing and and my wife. So that's a lot of fun. She had a good time, and. Uh, but yeah, the conditions uh, down here in Central Texas are still a little bit funny. Uh, but anyway, so we'll be moving out to Lake Whitney on our next tournament, which will be towards the end of this month. So that'll put me back in some familiar waters. But anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I know it didn't explain a whole lot, but to tell you the truth, I didn't really know what to say out there because I was just trying to figure everything out. These fish are weird out here. But anyway, guys, y'all take care. And tight lines, everybody. We'll see you on the next one.